for um, checking in to check it out. So, um, some news has been out for a little while now. I think it's, I think I heard about it probably a good few days ago now. And um, pretty much about what Nicki Minaj just said, what, what she tweeted, um, going against the clutch shots, you know, the clutch shot. Hopefully you know what I'm talking about with that. Don't want to say the word on here. Against the C19. Right? And she pretty much, you know, in so, in so many words, is saying that, that she ain't for it and that she ain't gonna that she ain't gonna take it, something like that. Okay. Now, this is she didn't really like she said it in a way where everyone knew what she means, but she didn't really like use any like direct words like don't take it because it's poison or whatever. Okay, she didn't really use any direct words, but everyone knew what she was trying to get. But my point is is that this is that that's, this is major because <laughs> This is like even the even the even the people over in America like um, who was it now? I don't know, someone in the White House, or whatever it was. Basically, it made waves on it. It made waves worldwide, and this is major. This is this is major stuff. And the reason why it's major is because somebody who is extremely famous to say the least right he's basically basically going against the powers that be yeah the people in the dark suits you don't really that more half of the, you don't really see half of the people in dark suits you don't you don't even see them okay she's blatantly she's blatantly going out speaking against them okay now again why is this major because m most Celebrities, high profile people do not go against the powers that be, okay? The powers that be, you know? The people who, who are all, the, the people who are running this show, the Jesuits, the Society of Jesus. And if you don't know about like, this kind of stuff, you need to go research. This is all, you can all find out who these people are, you know what I mean? People are lazy, they don't want to know about who these, who's running the show. You know what I mean? This this goes back hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years. These people have been, you know, the Jesuits being founded. But anyway, what you find is even all right, even more. What's the word? Even more lower profile people who have been sp who spoken out against this now. They've been uh, mysteriously bumped off, you know, just mysteriously died, you know, mysteriously just keeled over, you know, or mysteriously had an overdose, mysteriously died of pneumonia, you know, you know all this kind of stuff, right? You know, and it ain't no coincidence. You speak out against the powers that be; they don't like it. The chances are they'll get rid of you. So don't be surprised if we hear. If Nick, if Nicki Minaj does not retract, does not backtrack, and she stay and she stands her ground about what she said, chances are, let, okay, let, well, let's not be surprised if something happens to Nicki Minaj. You know, she might get involved in an accident, an overdose, you know, a heart attack, you know, all these little things, you know. So just don't be surprised if that does happen, because you speak about the powers that be, you speak out against the powers that be, they're coming for you. Especially if you're up, up high profile, they're fucking coming for you, eventually. So I'm not too sure what to expect. She might make a U-turn. You know, you know, who knows? Maybe in the next week or two, she might come out and say, "Hey." Or she might delete. She might delete the tweet. She might come out in the next week or two and say, "Hey, you know, um, I apologize for what I said. Um, you know, I, you know, I wasn't in a good place. Didn't really mean it. 
you know, you should follow the doctor's advice and all that stuff. You know what I mean? It's just so she could come out and backtrack. Again, I won't be surprised if that happens. If she don't, and she still stands firm. And if she and she and if she does that, if she does, if she does that, if she does speak out again about it again, then well, she spoke out it about it already. But if she speaks out about it again, man, fuck you know, like my hat goes off to her. My hat goes off to her already. You know what I mean? Because she's a big influencer. She influences a lot of people. You know, a lot. So if she ever does come out again and speak about it, and has the same views, um, you know, I. I I will highly rate her for that in these times because she's playing Russian roulette with her life really now. She's literally playing Russian roulette. And a lot of these celebrities, right, high profile people, they sell their soul, right? They sell that they sell, they sell their soul to the powers that be, you know? It's well known in Hollywood. It's well known, you know, in the music in the music industry. They sell their soul, and if you go against it, a lot of these mysterious deaths happen. You know, it happens all the time. So, salute to Nicki Minaj for for saying what she was saying. Um, and the reason why you don't hear more celebs talking about it because they're shit scared of the consequences. That's why. You know, all, all it will take is a few more high-profile people to really, you know, who, who's conscious and awake to really just come out and talk about it and say, hey, this ain't right. And that will have such an influence on people. That could literally turn the tide dramatically. Because a lot of people look up to these celebs, you know. But... You know, since these people are owned, these people these people are owned, man. You know, their own property, their 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 own property by other people. Yeah. So unfortunately, I don't think many more people are gonna speak out about it, especially someone like a Nicki Minaj status. Wow. But anyway, salute to her for doing that. Um. You know, basically anybody, you know. Everybody that's complying is responsible for our demise, all right? That's my little word, that's my saying. I've always said that from the start. Everybody that complies is responsible for our demise. You keep giving away your freedom, they'll keep taking it, and they won't, they'll, they'll, they'll take it and take more on top, yeah? Just like when you get a, a loan from the bank to put interest on, yeah? You keep giving away your freedom. They'll kill. They'll keep taking more. They'll take. They'll take. They keep more, 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 more. Okay. This could all stop tomorrow. This all this shit was going on now could all stop tomorrow if he just said no. I'm not having these fucking passports so I can go to the fucking supermarket. Yeah. Fucking 12 year olds are allowed to make a decision, a life changing decision about what goes in their body. When in the world has that have happened? But anyway, without, make, without making this video go on too long, that's all I pretty much wanted to say in this video. And um, with that, I'm out.